installing a O2 sensor defouler for our catalyst downpipe assemblies. And what this does is keeps you from getting a check engine light for not having a catalytic converter. You install this in the uh, orifice for the downstream O2 sensor on your downpipe. And then you install the O2 sensor in there. And what it does is cuts back the amount of fuel reading that that O2 sensor is getting so that it does not throw a check engine light. This particular unit has different orifices that it can be installed to change the flow rate. And I've actually put the largest one in because I don't want to cut it way down and cause it to throw a check engine light for efficiency being too low. I got this off of eBay and I will put a link in the description for it. But that's what we're installing today. Okay, we're currently under the car. This is my Mishimoto Catless Downpipe. And there's the O2 sensor that we're gonna remove. We're gonna take it out of here and unplug it from up here. That plug, and install our fitting, and then reinstall the O2 sensor over here. I'll be back in a moment once it's completed. Okay, as you can see, it is now installed. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, do yourself a favor, get this and install it before you put your downpipe in because boy, it is a job to put it in with it in because of clearance issues right here. I ended up having to take the downpipe bracket loose here and at the front of the transmission to give myself enough play that I could pry against the transmission cross member in the pipe to pull it away from the transmission enough to get enough clearance to thread it in. But there, as you can see, it is now completely installed. Y'all have a wonderful day.